A 47-year-old female with adenocarcinoma of the right breast is scheduled for a biopsy surgery to find the involved nodes. A radio tracer is injected by the tumor and the images are obtained. The first sentinel node in the patient is most likely found at what location? And we're looking for B, ipsilateral axilla. The breast is intimately tied to the drainage also in the axilla. And three quarters of the lymph from that breast will drain posteriorly towards the anterior lobe um, nodes. And those pectoral nodes or anterior nodes will then go back to the central nodes. Central nodes will then go to the axillary nodes, and then the axillary will go to supraclaviculars before being dumped back into the venous system. So it's important that you have a clear understanding of the pathway that the metastasizing breast cancers can gain access to the vascular stream. A patient was kicked by a horse in the lateral left thorax and is in severe pain. The rib has been fractured, but there's no lesion of the lung or pleural cavity. Where's the most likely site for this fracture? And we're looking for B, the angle of the rib. The angle of the rib is the component of the rib that's under the most tension and also a fracture point for the ribs in general. And remember, this angle is located more posteriorly. However, being kicked by a horse, if there's the potential that it would be fractured right at the site. But it's that elasticity in the ribs themselves, which are kind of like loaded springs uh, because of their anatomy, that allows them to fracture at sites different from the actual impact.